Oh, sorry, Jordy. <laughs> Okay, I don't know if anyone's still watching because we're starting a little late, but uh, hello everybody and welcome to Meet the Dog, a bit later than usual. Uh, I am your friendly local kennel assistant, Chris, and with me today is the last of the triples, Jordy. So first and foremost, I gotta apologize for the late start. We finally got a shipment of food today, and in the hubbub of all of that, I kind of forgot about Meet the Dog. So, uh, once again, sorry about starting a little later than usual. But uh, hopefully, if anyone's still watching, uh, they still get their Meet the Dog, uh, meet the dog fix in. <laughs> Alright. So, we have little Jordy here. He's the last member of our Tribbles litter, born back in March. His parents are Bianca and Trip, aka Sir Richard. Uh, who was actually just boarding with us uh, for the past week. He just left yesterday. Uh, so that was fun. Um, he is weighing in at 63 pounds. Uh, he eats three times a day. Uh, two cups each meal. Uh, all Actually, we recently just transitioned them to adult food. Uh, so they are not getting puppy food anymore. Uh, let's see what else. His stra training strengths include, I did see that I had to take a quick look at the training log today, and I do remember seeing that his pace is quite good, which is something I, I think all the triples have in common. I think all of them, uh, I've seen very good pace uh, for them. Um, also, their recall is fantastic. They are a just, they're just, they're really a w very well-behaved litter, I gotta say. Uh, all the triples are just very well. Uh, when it comes to their recall, their pace, just everything. Um, his weaknesses include, though, or I should say, things he needs to work on. Uh, he's some confidence issues uh, out in public, which, I mean, that's just kind of the normal puppy stuff, you know? He's, he's still getting into the world. He's still figuring things out, so I'm sure that'll work itself out with age. Uh, so, some fun facts about Mr. Jordy. So he is one of the twinnies, uh, him and Naomi, they are the two hardest of the litter to tell apart because they look almost identical. Uh, maybe you can see it, I'm not sure, but he has two little dots on his front right paw right there. It's, very, it's probably very hard to see because of the angle of the camera, but basically he has a sock on his front right paw and two black dots right there uh, so if I ever get confused with him and Naomi I just kind of look at I first I look at that front right paw and you just knock my phone over thank you Jordy <laughs> and if I see those two black dots I know it's Jordy if I don't I know it's Naomi and if I still get confused what I used to do is I just I check the undercarriage <laughs> if it's a boy I know it's my buddy Jordy here He's a real sweetheart, this one. All right, so I'm gonna open it to some questions. Uh, we got first up, we got Craftier. Uh, who are his best dog friends? Uh, that would be his sister Naomi and his brothers uh, Crusher and Wesley. His his sister Naomi, his twenty, uh, is his roommate, and they spend a lot of time together. Though I heard recently. I think I think it's Naomi that might be bullying him a little bit. I know one of the dogs is bull one of the, the uh, his siblings is bullying him a little bit. I think it's Naomi. So we might we, we're gonna have to keep an eye on them. Uh, but he plays a lot with uh, Crusher, Wesley, and Naomi. Uh, all the Tribbles get along real well. Uh, thankfully, still. <laughs> but those are the four he usually plays. The three he usually plays with the most. I will try to think of some I, any other uh, question. Oh, uh, fun fact from Craft Years: Today is the as his grandfather's birthday. I didn't know that. Thank you, Craft Year. 
You want to say happy birthday to your grandfather, Jordy? His name's Gromit. You want to say happy birthday to Grandpa Gromit? No, he's all distracted. Did you get him anything? No? No, okay, we'll get him something next year, though. You gotta stay on top of this, buddy. Pot calling the kettle black. I am terrible with birthday presents. <laughs> Craftier asks, how is he like his mother? Uh, so, the Tribbles are all very much like their mother. They're all very cuddly. They're all very, uh, assertive when they're trying to get attention. Um... Jordy, how Jordy is specifically like his mom. I... He's actually... I don't think he's a whole lot like his mom. He's actually... He's a very mellow dog. Um, I want to say he's a bit more like his father, but uh, I've only ever seen Trip while he's here, and while he's here, he's usually whining a whole lot. <laughs> but I, uh, yeah, I think I think he might take a bit more after his dad when it comes to personality. Craftier asks, "Did you have a?" Did you have an opportunity to spend time with his dad, Sir Richard? How is Sir Richard? How is Richard like his puppies? Uh, I had a little bit of an opportunity to spend time with Sir Richard. He was uh, over in laundry. He was boarding over there, so I got did get to spend a little time with him while I was over there. He's a, he's a real great dog. I love him. Um, I would say I don't know a whole lot about Sir Richard. Uh, just because he spends so few time here, and I, I, I do get some interaction with him, but I don't get as much as most of the dogs that I normally work with. Um, I actually, I, I don't see a lot of him in the Tribbles, but I do see a lot of, like, uh, he's a, the Christmas litter is a lot like him. Uh, the Christmas, the Tribbles are definitely a lot more like their mom. Uh, I think Jordy might be a bit more like his dad. He's very mellow. Uh... I don't know if that's what Trip is like when he's not here, but we'll see. Uh, Craftier asks, has he been on an overnight yet? No, not yet. Uh, I've been thinking about maybe taking one of the uh, triples for an overnight, but I have Emma, so I'm not sure whether that's a good idea. She has a very good temperament. I'm sure she'd be fine. I'm just a bit worried that she would, like, bowl them over, <laughs> and I really don't want that happening. Uh, but so far, no one, I don't think anyone else has taken the triples for an overnight yet. Uh, with the exception of Crusher, who went with Lynn when he hurt his foot. Very good. You're doing very well, Jordy. That's right, I have treats in my pocket. You want a treat, buddy? You're very well. All right. Uh, I'm going to give it a few more minutes for any last-minute questions about Jordy. Uh, again, sorry for the late start today. Uh, I, if anyone who is normally to, tunes in is not tuning in right now, uh, I, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Maybe I can apologize next week when you're watching. Uh, I'll try to think of anything myself. Uh, let's see. Things about stories about Jordy. Let's see. No, he's done something. What do you think? Hmm. Any last minute things about Jordy that I can think of? Start cycling back through the dogs. So that's gonna be fun. All right, I'm gonna give it another minute. Another minute for any last-minute questions about Jordy. Uh, Craftier, what's some information about Trip? Trip was born in Czech uh, and spent some time at STP upon arriving to the U.S. So he was from Czech. Okay, I was wondering if he was from Czech or not, because he looks so much like Evie 
and Emma. Their faces are almost identical. So I was wondering if they were related. So they might be. Um, so that's so... Hey, my Emma might be your, like, your cousin or your aunt or something. That would, that's going to be fun. Good boy. All right. I think that's going to be it for, uh, for Jordy. Uh, thank you for tuning in, folks. Sorry again about the late start. I promise I will be better about remembering next week. Uh, and next week, I don't know who we're going to do because we're out of triples, so we're going to have to cycle back through to some of the older dogs. So uh, maybe we'll see if uh, someone like Rambo or Fred wants to do meet the dog again. It's been a while for them. All right, so thank you everyone for tuning in. Uh, I will see you all next week.